Let's go through an example of calculating the correlation coefficient. The following are library rankings for the public libraries in the U.S. that service populations greater than 500,000. This data comes from Hennen's American Public Library Ratings. I believe there's a positive correlation between the expenditures per capita and the visits per capita. That is, as expenditures increase, visits will increase as well. I'll start by graphing the data to make sure it's linear. So I'm going to highlight the ranges there and go to Insert, Scatter Chart, Scatter with Only Markers. Just go ahead and copy and paste this over to a new sheet here. And I'm going to put a trend line in. And you can see that there is a linear relationship between the expenditures and the visits. All right, so now I'm going to calculate the correlation coefficient, or, or R, to see if there's a correlation between the two variables. So I'm going to do equals corel. Select the first set of values, comma, and push enter. And there is a strong correlation, 0.71. The um, perfect correlation is 1, but anything greater than 0.5 is considered a strong correlation. So 0.71 is a very strong correlation. Remember though that correlation does not necessarily equal causation. For starters, this is only one year's worth of data. Additionally, other variables could affect visits as well, like number of librarians per capita, number of computers per capita, electronic expenditures per capita, collection turnover, etc. Hope this makes sense, and I'll see you next time.